I'm Nick Manacki from Pixel. We're here at NAB 2012 with Tim. He's a senior software engineer at GoPro. Tim, tell us about uh, what you got going on over here. All right, so for at NAB 2012, we're announcing a, a, a new firmware, a free firmware update for the GoPro Hero 2. It'll be available uh, very soon. What ProTune is designed to do is really enable the professional market, professional users to incorporate the Hero 2 into their workflow, into their productions a lot easier. Uh, give it a higher quality image, easier image to manipulate. Um, the way we do that with ProTune, we work with the color uh, to develop a, a log curve. Gives you a nice flat looking image, preserves a lot of detail, higher dynamic range, gives you nice highlights, nice shadows that you can pull in later, you can color correct with. Um, you know, traditional GoPro Hero content is punchy, it's saturated, it's contrasted, yeah. it looks awesome, but you don't have a lot of flexibility in post to match right. it with the other sources and to make it make it look how you want. Right. You know, uh, whatever comes out of the camera kind of is what it is. But with ProTune, it really enables you to, to push the image, uh, really enables you to pick how you want it to look. Um, part of what enables that is a higher bit rate. Uh, we have 35 megabits per second, H.264. It's one of the highest uh, bit rates in its class, one of the highest of H.264 uh, okay. period. So, um, for high motion, a lot cleaner. You don't have the compression artifacts. Um, and we also enable 24p. So all your other sources are 24p. Your can, you know, your DSLRs, your Reds, your all shit 24p. Well, now you can incorporate the Hero 2 with that workflow without having to do a frame rate conversion in post. So right. uh, this whole suite of features, it's all going to be in Pro Tunes, a free firmware update, and uh, all Hero 2 users will get it. Sweet, sweet. So real quick, take us through the workflow. We got the image. We're going to import it into our computer. That's right. Okay. All right. So you've got your your, your Pro Tune H264. Um, it's a, a high bit rate. It's kind of, it's a, because of the high bit rate, because of the H264, it's kind of slow in its native format. Uh -huh. We recommend that you transcode. Okay. So it's a transcode workflow uh, we recommend. Uh, with GoPro Cineform Studio, uh, it'll automatically convert it into a Cineform, uh, GoPro Cineform AVI or MOV. Uh, you can use that file in your Final Cut, your Adobe Premiere, your Sony Vegas, Avid, wherever you want to use it. Right. You can put that file in there. And uh, with Cineform Studio, it also allows you to, to color correct it in there. Or if you want to use your other color correction tools, you can do that too. And once you have it in that visual intermediate, you can do anything you want with it. Awesome, awesome. Check them out. All right, yeah, sure.